It is really hot out today. It is the 16th of June here in southeastern Ontario, but I took my hat off, put my sunglasses up on my head because I found something in the garden and I wanted to make a little video all about it. Look at what is here at my tomatoes. Right there. <gasps> there is a fully formed tomato growing on actually quite a little plant here. It's got some flowers too, the leaves look pretty good, but anytime you see a tomato like that, even though you might want to jump for joy and think, oh, I'm an excellent gardener, I personally worry when it's this soon into the season. Tomatoes are how this plant is going to make seeds to ensure that its species survives into another generation. And if it's trying to make its seeds this soon, it might mean that the plant is quite stressed out. Maybe not enough nutrients, although I don't see discoloration on the leaves. Maybe it just is feeling like this is too hot of a summer, too fast. With global warming, that's a very good possibility. Apparently with the Humidex, it's supposed to be above 40 degrees Celsius this week. Oh my goodness. But when this happens and you start to see that your plant is preparing for its end of life, you can help to turn things around by babying it a little bit. So that's exactly what I intend to do. Make sure that it doesn't get too stressed from being too dry. Make sure that I am feeding it gently every couple of weeks, just keeping an eye on it, pruning those lower leaves so that it's not trying to combat disease and try to give it a you know, new lease on life so that these little flowers that you also see on it, right there, will turn into future tomatoes and this plant will just keep on going. And that tomato will be an early one, but the first of many. The garden's always trying to tell you something. Pay attention, try to figure out what the plant is trying to do, and that can help you shift things a little bit so that your goal aligns with the plant's goal. And however your garden grows, keep growing as a gardener.